Hey y'all, so I wanted to give a quick disclaimer before you watch the video. I am going to be talking about a seasonal product that is not currently available, but when I did my product stash video, a lot of you guys said that you wanted me to go ahead and upload this footage anyways. So that is the first disclaimer. And the second disclaimer I wanted to tell you guys is that you will notice that this video was recorded with my old setup. I actually recorded this video a long time ago and I'm just getting around to uploading it. So just wanted to let y'all know that. Hope you enjoy the video. <laughs> y'all it's your girl mo of all things mo l welcome back to my channel so i'm excited for today's video because i'm going to be trying out a new deep conditioner well it's technically not new but it's new to me but it's from a brand that i know and i love and y'all know that i know and love it um that brand is sotanical so if you're interested in seeing me try out one of their seasonal deep conditioners then just keep on watching but of course before we get into it please take a moment and go down below hit that subscribe button because we would love to have you as a part of the fam okay and while you're down there go ahead and hit the notification bell so that you will not miss when I post new uploads all right so the deep conditioner of the hour is from Sultanicals and I am trying out their Miss Frosty deep repairing frosterizer with cocoa butter and baobab protein now this is my first time using this apparently it's been released a few times before it was released this past winter I believe that there are three products that um, she released in her winter seasonal line it was this one a hair grease and then I believe like a charcoal wash or something like that I picked this one and the hair grease up so I'm going to be trying this out on camera for the very first time for you guys today so let's just go ahead and jump into it so my hair of course has been cleansed already I used the mega greens butter shampoo that's also from sultanicals and this is what my hair is looking like prior to deep conditioning now, some people, after they use their butter shampoos, they just stop right there. They don't really have to use a deep conditioner, but I'm extra and I like to deep condition, so, okay. <laughs> so, you guys know when I'm trying out deep conditioners, there's a few things that I tend to always look for. First of all, I want to know how it smells because sometimes deep conditioners do linger and I want to make sure that it is a nice smell. I also look for the application, like I want to see how good the spreadability is how evenly does it distribute through my hair without me having to do too too much work to spread it also I like to see if it has slip now slip is not something that I require in a deep conditioner because usually by the time I get to the deep conditioning stage my hair is already pretty detangled but I do like to check and see if it has slip and then of course we want to know if it's moisturizing and not just moisturizing when it's in the hair but moisturizing when it's out of the hair because that's the whole purpose of deep conditioning sis okay all right so that is what i am looking for we are gonna go ahead and try this product out so as far as the smell honestly i can't really smell anything it has a very light scent i honestly can't even really smell it at all but it is a thicker consistency deep conditioner it feels really good on my hands so let's see how it feels on the hat rubbing it in feels good Okay. I can tell that this is a super moisturizing deep conditioner like I could just tell by how it feels going into my hair all right, you guys, so as I mentioned, the notable ingredients in this product include cocoa butter and baobab protein. I will try to find a full ingredients list and put that in the description box for you guys. I also wanted to let you guys know about some of the claims of this deep conditioner, and it claims to instantly condition and soften the hair. It claims to reinforce the strands for improved strength. It claims to return your hair's elasticity, and it also claims to reduce breakage. Okay, you guys, so I'm back. I've just applied the Miss Frosty deep conditioner throughout my entire head, and first impressions. 
Miss Frosty. Go girl. I like you girl. This thing is extremely moisturizing going on to my hair. It did have good spurtability. It didn't have the most slip. This is not something that I would solely rely on to detangle my hair. It had decent slip but not the most. So far it just feels really good on my hair. It looks shiny and juicy. It's starting to like really shrink up in the back which is letting me know that like you know my hair is getting good and moisturized so the directions say to leave it on for 20 minutes or more so that's what I'm going to do not gonna sit under my steamer today because I don't feel like I need to um I'm just going to put on a plastic cap do some things around the house so after I rinse it out I will come back and give you guys my final thoughts on this product so be right back All right, y'all, so I am back. I have rinsed out that deep conditioner. I would say that I probably had it in for about 45 to 55 minutes, and this is what my hair is looking like. She's looking good. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. She feels good, too. Now, because that deep conditioner was so moisturizing, I was afraid that when I rinsed it out, my hair would feel like mushy, like maybe too much moisture. But no, I have to say that that Baobab protein stepped in and did exactly what it needed to do to balance this deep conditioner out. And I love my results. Like, my hair feels nice and hydrated, but it feels strengthened at the same time. And it's soft. Like, <laughs> that's a lot. <laughs> So needless to say, I am pleased. So just as a recap, um, I don't, still don't really like, I smell something, but it's like super, super lightweight to the point to where I can't even describe what it smells like. So a very faint scent. So people who are sensitive to smells, you might appreciate this. As far as application, I really loved how it applied. My hair seemed to soak it up and absorb it instantly. It just really treated my strands with like some TLC. I love that. Like I said before, this product did not have the most slip. I was able to detangle some, but I would not rely on this as my sole detangler just because it doesn't have that much slip to me. But again, I don't look for slip in deep conditioners, so I don't really care about slip because honestly, the performance, like outweighed that to me and yeah i have to 100 say that i really love this 100 recommend it let's chat below per usual tell me have you tried this deep conditioner are you going to purchase it have you used it let's chat about this below and yeah that's pretty much it i hope that you guys found the video informative if you did please give me a big thumbs up because those really help my channel out and i will see you guys in my next one bye